Neighbors were caught off guard when that shooting took place earlier this morning. Yeah, some of them were outside when the shots rang out. Fox Force Tia Johnson continues our team coverage tonight, and Tia residents in that normally quiet neighborhood are certainly shocked. Yeah, John, they're shocked and they tell me they never expected this to happen in their neighborhood. They also say tonight their thoughts and prayers are with the officer's family and the police department. We all have kids, like all of us have kids. There's a bunch of us down here that have kids. It's scary. A neighborhood where kids love to play turned into a crime scene. That's not okay. Like I was shaken. I couldn't believe it. Police lights and crime scene tape remain where a man shot and killed a North Kansas City police officer. It was only a block away from Megan Osborne's house. And there was people surrounding up there. There was a woman cop like being like just on the ground crying. There was a man like being held like that it was they are clearly like distraught. Like. Missouri State Highway Patrol says the officer Daniel Vasquez attempted a traffic stop. A man driving the car got out, started shooting at Vasquez and drove off. Wasn't like how you would imagine it. You hear it in the movies and it's like a pop pop pop, but this was much louder and much it was very frightening. Jessica Jennings says she was sitting on her porch and didn't expect to hear those shots. I ran down to the end of my walkway here and I saw the car leaving the the Ford Taurus speeding away. She has a son who loves to play outside too. We have him out in the yard. He's having fun. You know, not just us, our neighbors. This street is full of children. It's this is a family family place. As you heard, this is a neighborhood where kids play outside a lot. Neighbors told me they're happy no kids were outside during the shooting. Christelle.